In this video, we'll examine the benefits of a gas lift system and walk you through the two main types of gas lift. We will discuss the individual components of the system. And finally, we will examine common flow type configurations and discuss best practices recommended by our expert production services team. What is gas lift and why would you choose it as an artificial lift method? Gas lift is the most natural form of artificial lift where gas is injected into the well casing to bring liquids up to the surface, usually through the production tubing. The system takes advantage of the well's own energy. Producers use one of two types of gas lift, depending on the production profile of the well, continuous or intermittent. We will focus on continuous gas lift for the purposes of this video. However, there are specific times and well types that can benefit from the introduction of intermittent gas lift. Intermittent gas lift is often elected where the formation pressures have dropped to levels where continuous flow is no longer sustainable, or for relatively high formation pressures, but low productivity. The most advantageous benefit is to reduce injection gas. On average, only about 10% of gas lifted wells are placed on intermittent lift, mostly in mature fields. Continuous gas lift has a wide range of applicability. Liquid production rates from a few hundred barrels to tens of thousands of barrels are possible. Once the type of gas lift is decided, a gas lift design is created to help determine spacing and quantity of the valves required. Now we move on to the operation of the gas lift system, starting with the compressor. If the well or pad does not produce sufficient formation gas to achieve production goals, then low pressure natural gas is compressed via the surface compressor and will travel into the injection line. The compressor horsepower requirements are considered in the analysis and design of the gas lift system. The gas is injected into the tubing casing annulus of the well and flows up the tubing to a surface separator and ready for storage and transportation to the refinery. Most gas lift valves open in reaction with a specified gas pressure in the tubing casing annulus. The casing pressure compresses a bellows inside the valve and raises the stem off-seat to open the valve. When the gas enters the tubing through the gas lift valve, the energy of the expanding gas propels the liquids closer to the surface. The gas also aerates the fluid column, lowering its density and allowing it to flow more easily to the surface. Floco also offers a high pressure valve with an inverted bellows for specific well applications. These valves enable a higher flow rate and more stable lift regime for high pressure application than a traditional IPO valve. Although all gas lift wells function basically with the same engineering principles, there are multiple variations of gas lift systems used to optimize production based on well type and downhole conditions. We will focus on the six most common gas lift configurations. Here we see a tubing flow gas lift on a well with a packer installation. We see the gas coming down the tubing casing annulus. An installation with a packer may be referred to as semi-closed, and this is widely used for continuous flow operations. A packer is often installed on a new well for increased well control and ease of equipment installation. A packer also can prevent fluid and flow re-entry into the tube and casing annulus. In a well shutdown, such as a compressor malfunction or if the well is shut in for any reason, this enables faster kickoff when the injection gas is resumed. Most tubing flow gas lift installations include a packer to stabilize the fluid level in the tube and casing annulus and prevent injection gas from blowing around the lower end of the tubing in wells with a low flowing bottom hole pressure. Here we see a tubing flow gas lift installation without a packer. An installation without a packer may be referred to as open. We see the gas coming down the tubing casing annulus. 
An open installation is recommended for low liquid rate wells or in conjunction with a plunger lift system. An annular flow gas lift system is recommended for new wells or high liquid volume wells. Sometimes an operator will select this flow path based on certain well conditions. Selecting this configuration could be to maximize fluid rates and lower flowing bottom hole pressure or for deep injection required in a highly deviated well bore. Here we see a packer bypass lift system with tubing and gas lift valves installed above the packer and a bypass assembly installed in the packer. Injected gas can travel through the packer. This allows the injection gas to reach the end of the tubing below the packer in the curve of the well bore. This is the ideal point of lift to achieve the lowest flowing bottom hole pressure and lowest flowing gradient. The increased annular velocity system, or IAV, provides tubing flow gas lift valves that are installed above a packer, along with a properly sized injection string with internally mounted gas lift valves below the packer. It is imperative to use the proper tubing size and injection string to keep unloading velocities above critical rate and successfully sweep liquids from the reservoir. This application is recommended for long perforated intervals and low reservoir pressure. Below packer gas lift requires no alterations to the wellhead and installation is simple. The ability to annular flow high initial rates, then switch to tubing flow as rates decrease without a workover rig is a large cost savings to operators. Hybrid gas lift can help achieve this goal. Critical data is gathered to ensure proper selection of valve sizes, port size, and recommended mandrel spacing to handle the higher and lower rates. With the necessary data collected, a high-accuracy nodal analysis model is developed to enable an optimized gas lift design. Our teams have years of experience with this and many other production challenges and opportunities. A permanent downhole gauge is a ruggedized pressure temperature measurement instrument permanently or semi-permanently installed on the production string. Typically, they are attached with the tubing and can measure the tubing pressure or tubing casing annulus pressure or both. Other configurations, placement, and tools are also available. The data that the downhole gauge provides is useful to the production or reservoir engineer in determining the reserves, flowing bottom hole pressure, and other critical production decisions. The absence of accurate and reliable data can create significant operational inefficiencies and puts artificial lift systems and the reservoir at risk. Recent breakthroughs in technology such as the Apex multi-well controller takes advantage of AI to optimize production and adjust injection rates. The Apex multi-well controller can optimize gas lift, plunger lift, hybrid lift systems, gapple and paggle wells and bring in multiple data points such as compressor data, tank levels, downhole data and more. The new technology brings enhanced computing power, production possibilities and optimization capabilities to either an individual well or a pad of connected assets, up to 16 wells. The controller is a life of well solution for the entire life cycle of the wells. The Apex controller works with current equipment and SCADA system, and ours. Optimal control and production of the well can be automated and remote weather points are manually set and assigned by the operator or the assignments made by the AI algorithms in the controller. Specific game-changing gas lift technology features include the ability to control the well on operator-specified rates and parameters, or the ability to optimize the well automatically. The Apex multi-well controller can also perform a kickoff of the system with the built-in AI control. This technology, new to the industry, allows the built-in AI algorithm to optimize the gas injection rate in one of two ways. 1. Critical velocity of produced gas, or 2 injection gas optimized based on drawdown of flowing bottom hole pressure gathered from a live downhole gauge. Nodal analysis is an exceptional tool that aids in artificial lift selection, gas lift design and optimization of injection gas rates. 
It shows how much production to expect or how a well might respond to the introduction of an artificial lift system. It also shows what to expect when making changes to an existing system. Let the production experts at Floco Production Solutions help you address the challenges and optimize the opportunities for your well, field, or reservoir.